if I was prone to seizures, this game would be fatal. This is Otherland, a new early access MMO that just hit Steam a few days ago. Now yes, this is early access, so everything could change, and of course it's too early to make any snap judgments about the game or the glitches that I experienced, but I'm going to anyway. Otherland is alright. I experienced a lot of glitches, but at least it's got personality. If by personality you mean Tron. Okay, not exactly like Tron, but it's Tron. Which is kind of funny because the game is kind of a game in a game and it's hard for me to decide if the glitches I experienced were due to early access or maybe it was intentional. It's getting kind of meta in here. You'll be playing this little weird robo dude or dudette. You'll run through a brief tutorial where you'll learn to run around and customize your character. Customization options at this point in the game are rather limited, but you'll get to choose a few more options later in the game. At this point though, all you'll get to choose are your racing stripes and your body color. Am I a transformer? I wish I was a transformer. Damn, my guy's got some junk in his trunk. Then it's time to test out the classes of the game. Combat in Otherland is kind of action-ish. You'll have to aim with your cursor and then start clicking. Right click will do a bigger attack that you might need to charge up, and your number keys will do special attacks. But it doesn't seem like you can miss, so yeah. It's not really action combat. Classes, let's see here. Marksman, AKA a guy with a gun or a bow. Warrior, AKA a guy with a giant ax or hammer thing. Assassin, AKA a futuristic rogue with daggers and a katana. And Energizer, not that one. AKA an intergalactic ghostbuster who also has a rocket launcher and is a healer. Jeez, why the hell do you even have other classes? Bland, bland, kinda cool. Yeah. Then it's time for some story. I destroy these pillars and a chair. Oh yeah, I'm just that badass. Suck it, chair. And then, whoopsie. Oh, my bad, everyone, my bad. So here's one of the downsides to Otherland at least in the early game. Questing is really basic. Pick up a quest, run to another NPC, all of which have cool names, with, with a K, so you know it's cool, like crit you into face. I don't care if it has to do with the story of the game or not, I wanna punch this guy in his jugular. And then you're gonna kill stuff. Lots and lots of killing stuff. Now it turns out the Energizer can use several different types of weapons, all of which damages enemies and heals allies differently. It was definitely a cool way to incorporate healing into the game. I mean, my rocket launcher heals people. <laughs> I'm so happy, but that's kind of about it. The game has some good ideas and a good setting, but the early game is very basic MMO questing. The setting is really cool, so hopefully the game has enough ideas to support it and keep people playing, because futuristic ghost busting will only get you so far. I mean, it'll get you a lot further than most, but you know what I mean. Make sure to level up your MMO knowledge by visiting MMORPG.com, subscribing to our YouTube channel, and by following us on social media. To catch up on the week's biggest MMO news, watch our latest MMO FTW. And to see if there's a better MMO out there for you, watch one of our latest First Impressions videos. Thanks for watching.